Tatum's not home. He's in school. You're lying to me. I know he's here. Tatum, come to the door. I made it. I proved that I loved you. Chelsea, where's your car? I walked. That's like 10 miles. I know, but I saved everybody, and now I have to prove to Tatum that I loved him, so I walked. What are you talking about? Are you okay? Tatum, just kiss me so I can wake up. No. No, don't kiss me. I love Jehovah God more than I love you. Do you hear that, Jehovah? Thank you for keeping her here. We had no idea where she went. Is she gonna be okay? You should probably go back inside. <sighs> no, I need to talk to Tatum. No, you need to come with us. Come with me and mom, Chelsea. We love you very much. No, you're lying. Listen, everything is going to be okay. It's gonna be okay, Daddy. I lost everything for everybody, but I died and got it back. Where are we going? To the hospital. <laughs> Where's my purse? What? Where's my purse? I don't have my blood card. You're not going to need it. What are we doing here? I'm just going to sign your name in. No, I don't have my blood card. You're not going to need it. I need my blood card! Help! Chelsea! Help! Hi. Help! Jehovah, help me! Okay. Help me! You're not gonna get to me, you awful son of a bitch. I'm gonna protect myself, you fucker. You're not gonna get to me. She's finally awake. Hi, my name is Chelsea. This looks like a hospital. Why am I here? You'll be here for a while because you're sick. What? I don't understand. Why would a hospital be in paradise? The doctor's gonna come talk to you in a little bit. Don't worry. In the meantime, you can use any of the phones in any of the rooms. Hello? Mom? Chelsea, how are you? What am I doing here, Mom? Where are you and Dad? Okay, but I don't understand why I'm in here if I saved everybody. Mom, where's Donna and Melissa? I went to their houses, but they weren't home. Did they die in Armageddon? Just make sure you take whatever they give you, Chelsea, okay? Okay. All right. I love you. Remember, your father and I love you very much. Okay. I love you too, Mom. Doctor, we'll see you now, Chelsea. Okay. Thank you, Peter.
Do you know why you're here, Chelsea? I don't know. I guess it has something to do with me saving the world. I died for everyone, and now they can all live in peace forever. I reversed what Eve took away from all of us. Eternal life. But why are you here? So that I can forget the old world. It was so horrible that when people die and God brings them back, they have to have some place to go to forget all the pain. But I rescued everyone. And now they won't feel any pain anymore from all the people who God destroyed in Armageddon. No drugs were found in Chelsea's system. Has she been under any significant stress lately? She just graduated from high school. She was an A student. And she writes screenplays. She wants to become a screenwriter. What does this all mean, Doctor? She's been doing those things since she was in fifth grade. Nothing like this has happened before. 18, Chelsea's age, is the average age at which these episodes can occur. What medication? I feel fine. You don't remember being given any medications at all? No. What are her plans after high school? She'll be attending Prince George's Community College to be a paralegal. And she's going to be pioneering. Pioneering? We're Jehovah's Witnesses. So she'll be dedicating 70 hours a month to knocking on people's doors and preaching. What about screenwriting? Pioneering is what our children do. Chelsea can still be a screenwriter. Jehovah's Witnesses can be whatever they want to be. So long as they put the ministry first, we preach just as Jesus did. My name is Jessica Chelsea. My initials are JC. My mother's name is Mary. My father's name is Joe. Just like Joseph and Mary. God made me born specifically to them so I could die and save humanity. I died, Dr. Morgan. My heart stopped beating and I stopped breathing. that down. That wouldn't have been possible in the old world. It may be schizoaffective disorder, but it's too soon to tell if this will only happen once. For right now, let's call it psychosis NOS. What is NOS? Not otherwise specified. Psychosis is an impairment with reality where delusions or hallucinations may occur. One of the triggers may be extreme stress. But, uh, Dr. Murray? Wait. Excuse me just a moment. She came to me about a week ago and asked, how do you know you're in love? She asked you? She said everyone keeps asking her when she's getting married. She and Tatum aren't that serious, are they? You know how the brothers and sisters can be. You know the expectations. Don't blame it on the truth. Chelsea just tries to be so perfect at everything. The doctor doesn't need to know any of this. It'll just make the witnesses look bad. This is not our fault. For those of you that are new, my name is Salada, and we go around a circle every night and we talk about what our goal for the day was and whether or not we accomplished our goal. Betty, let's begin with you. I don't want to go. I want to hear what everyone else has to say first. Okay. George, how about you? I don't know. Go home, I guess. 
And did you accomplish your goal today? I didn't. I didn't. Danny, how about you? Did you accomplish your goal? My goal was to get out of here today. I'm still here. There's always tomorrow, Danny. Oh, it's always tomorrow, Salada. I ain't out of here yet. I don't know how you're supposed to get out of here. What do you mean? I mean, everyone wants to get out of here, but nobody knows how to do it. I won't be here long. <laughs> Good luck. I've been in here for weeks. I still ain't out yet. All right, let's move on. Ethel, what about you? I accomplished my goal today. I'm being discharged tomorrow. I don't see how you did it. I wish you'd tell me a thing or two. Chelsea, you're new, but do you have a goal today? What about tomorrow then? To forget everything from the old world so I can get out of here? So why is her name no, Mara? Today. That means bad in Spanish. I don't know, maybe her parents don't speak Spanish. She looks Hispanic. Maybe that's just the name she gave herself. I can't always make out what she's saying. What I hear scares me. Does she always talk to herself? Don't worry, you'll get out of here. And when I figure it out, I'll let you know. Thank you for watching over me, Peter. You're welcome, Chelsea. Please thank Jesus for me, for letting you leave heaven to be my guardian angel. I'm sorry, all those people can't come to see her at once. You see, we're in paradise now. Everybody loves each other. I'm so glad you made it. Were you one of Jehovah's Witnesses before Armageddon? Chelsea, sweetie, it, it doesn't work that way. Aren't you going to come see me, Tatum? Aren't you? My parents don't want you to call here anymore. Your parents? I'm sorry, Chelsea. I'm really sorry if I caused this to happen to you. How are you feeling today, Chelsea? I'm starting to remember things from earlier this week. Like what? Screaming, yelling at my parents, not trusting them. You had a psychotic episode. Like a nervous breakdown? Uh, the term nervous breakdown is not recognized medically. But for your lack of a better term, yes. Disassociation can be caused by extremely stressful situations. So what am I stressed about? Is it falling in love? Are you in love? I don't know. I don't know if I love him enough to marry him. We just started talking. I mean, I love him, or I think I do. Is this going to happen every time I fall in love? I doubtful that just falling in love is what brought this on. Then what is it? I've just been living my life.
looks like we just graduated high school. Yeah. What do you think you're gonna do after high school? Um, pioneering. What about you? I guess I was thinking the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> I really want to go to I'm not going to hurt you. It's going to be okay. <laughs> I do remember. I've been remembering more bits and pieces every day. When my heart stopped, it was probably some sort of panic attack. And I don't think I died anymore. I didn't save the world. Honey, I'm going to make you some spaghetti when you get out of here. Your favorite. Let me use the bathroom before we leave. Okay. Daddy? Yes? I don't think I can do this anymore. What? All of it. There are too many, too many unnecessary rules and regulations. If you ever stop loving Jehovah, I'm not going to love you anymore. Daddy. <sighs> I'll always love you, kid. Chelsea, you go home tomorrow, but you'll still need to come back every day for the next two weeks. Outpatient therapy to learn how to manage stress. What good is that if I don't know what's stressing me out? Well, thank you, Pedro, for everything. Chelsea, what was your goal today? To be discharged. And did you accomplish the goal? I'm going home tomorrow. How in the hell did you manage that? I took my medicine. 